things. Mm -hmm. We're looking some stretches in Kiyoshiki. He's not the camera. Yep. Waving back to the people at home. And they're good to play. Good luck, good luck. Let's start it up. Three, two, one, go! Double Pika versus Pika Kirby. Yeah, and that is that is Japan is with Pika Kirby. And like I say, that's last set. yeah. They they were starting a lot of sets as double Pika, but I I think that they ended up switching to Pika Kirby so often they've just decided not to lose a game before they do it. We have Takos' Ghostly Rat, Alvin is Solid Color. Ghostly yes. And Team Japan does take the first stock. Kiyoshi's really showing that his Pico is really excellent. Oh, they, do, they don't get the gimmick. Absolutely. That was fantastic. Uh, Kiyoshi took ledge so that the Pico would be forced to go on the stage as Pico are edge guarded. That's one thing you can edge guard Pikachu, but it sort of takes two characters. It does, yeah. You have to be everywhere at once, and that's hard as one character, but not so hard as two. Yeah, I I really don't like that team hit from green team. Yeah, looking a little bit out of whack, but so far, that's Fukuro gonna get Oh Fukuro gets the hit the on Tacos. And now here's Alvin with an edge guard. Now he's he decides to back out. So do their down air. Trying with the dash coming up to us. Fukuro was trying to screen Takos out. They were sort of, he was sort of trying to maintain the 1v1. Right, again, this is good stage position back. for Green Team. Kiyoshi looking very fluid around the stage with his edge guard. Yeah, but even though Green Team has been able to maintain a lot of good stage position, it's been hard for them to really make it pay. Yeah, absolutely. And Japan is just. An absolute wall. They're, they're, yeah. they're not giving them any slack. And the thing is, like, you can see Kiyoshi is on the ledge, and Fukuro is just sitting on the opposite side of the stage. He has total faith in Kiyoshi's ability to come back. He doesn't want to go in and hit Kiyoshi on accident. Very concerned with him. Very intelligent as well. Look at that. just back airing, back airing. Yeah, and making him back to his own opponent. Team. Or his own teammate, rather. Yoshi's ledge options right now are looking amazing. I cannot wait to see the Pikachu in singles. I'll, I'll be sad when doubles is over because it's looking pretty hot right here. Really nice. Hopefully we can keep it up. Alright, so now Green Team's got the separation. Yeah, up across the stage it kills. Each. Yeah. And there they managed to take the lead back. Crazy how quick they made that shot. And he just barely gets the down tilt, that's all he needs. Now Blue Team is starting to clean it up. There's still only one stock ahead. But it's looking... Or... or oh, oh, I'm, off the there. oh I'm, I'm sorry, I got confused. Yeah, Blue Team is, uh, has taken the lead back again. Yes. So even this one game has been a real roller coaster. Back and forth, back and forth. They're out of nowhere. Can't edge guard it yet. One of them might be able to. Wow, Pika's slipping through both characters. Yeah, so Takos and Alvin already have a pretty high percent and for Alvin the position they're in. Yeah. yeah, Alvin wants to be cautious. Secures the back row. Yeah, but it's not, it's not gonna kill it. At most it's gonna give him a little time. It's <laughs> very... Very high tension situation when both of Pikachu's on, on the green team are right on top of each other. You're always so scared to do anything. Wow! That could be the game changer for Blue Team. That was an excellent interaction for their, their yeah, favorite. But Fukuro is just too good. good. Yeah, yeah, Fukuro is still alive. Saves Kiyoshi and that's it. The back is there. Yeah, he managed that's to clinch a stock when he was coming back. He managed a swindle on the edge guard. Oh, the edge guard. Sorry, that, uh, that fair is not going to be secured on this version. Oh, that draw, up smash. And he gets the thunder. Yoshi's Pika looking fantastic. Yeah, Fukuro's Kirby providing excellent support. 
So Team Japan is looking like they they might not have had that much practice in this format, but they're a quick study. Exactly, yeah. And, and Kukuro is absolutely just playing that very, very strong support. And Kiyoshi is, is willingly adapting to becoming the, the super offensive player, the, the star player, rather. The, uh, the striker. Quite the, he's definitely the, the quarterback in this situation. Yeah, I, I like to call that role the striker role. The striker, yeah, that's true, yeah. He's definitely going out and making things happen. And you see Fukuro just sort of hanging out in the air, waiting, uh, waiting for a chance to do something. So Takos and Alvin still staying double rat. It is true they do have a whole set to play with. Fukuro just... Sniping out uh, Yeah, Team Japan with another divide. Neither player wow. letting like letting up at all. Fukuro has uh has Tacos totally tied up. Exactly. Kyoshi yeah. managed to edge guard out. Yeah. So hard to get out of uh, Fukuro's loop there when he put up side, uh, side platform. Trading back and forth. Put down on the down smash. Great edge. Yeah, Blue Team is just able to put him back exactly in the same situation. This lead is becoming more and more solid as we see it. And this is the way they're playing this game. It's th They're just not letting up at all. They're they're not giving Green Team anything, and Green Team is having a lot of trouble finding an answer. Absolutely, yeah. It, it seems that the Japanese style is, is to make you feel like there's just this impending doom and it's coming for you. I mean, to be fair, this is a strategy that, that Takos and Alvin have both used a lot themselves. Definitely. Japan is just, with the edge guards that Fukuro is, is They're uh, airtight. Wow. That's a great edge guard for Alvin as well. That back here is going to land with no kill. Excellent uh, attempt to save there for Fukuro before there. Yeah, we had a real pileup for a second. His ledge play is fantastic, getting the, getting the ledge without having that you know, you might have a point, that might really be the thing that set Japan's team play apart from other teams, is that Absolutely. they have simply not let anybody back. Wow. That was, a, that was an extremely hard read. That could have been, yes. <laughs> I'm not sure if that was a misdemeanor or a hard read. Wow. So does Alvin. And Blue Team is just out. not letting up. They're not giving Green Team a chance to play. Alvin secures the back air. Yeah, but now what, what can exactly they do? Exactly. Yeah, they, they do nothing against Fukuro in the, between the stocks. He doesn't let him. He just stays yeah. in the sky and he has these, these non committal approaches here. That yeah, and then Kyoshi comes back with invincibility and look where we are. And that's, and that's Fukuro the Owl. He stalks you. He stalks his prey. He will strike when he pleases. With no warning. He's up there. He's flying around. It makes sense. Excellent there after being pushed off the platform. Yeah. Oh, that was not an essential. And I said for all the praise you've been heaping on them, the stock count is even. Oh, was even. Alvin just dies. Yeah, Tacos hanging on to this last stock. That forward tilt, fantastic one through the shield. And that will probably be it. Oh, what's happening here? Excellent. And, and Team Japan is just continuing to roll. That's two games. They've got the boiler stoked. Yeah. They've got the engine burning. That train's coming. It's on a roll. It's on a roll, and it's <laughs> it's going to be the last stop. Yeah. So it, and it's looking like it's going to roll straight into set two. Takas and Alvin still sticking with the double rat. It is true, switching to Pika Kirby has not paid great dividends to other teams that have tried it against Team Japan. This revenge is looking quite imminent. Excellent team combo. Both go high and no edge guards. That's actually very unexpected. They die almost simultaneously. And that's just been the story of this set so far. Alvin and Tacos need to take a second. Yeah, Al like Alvin, I feel like Alvin and Tacos haven't been able to leverage their greatest, like, what would be their greatest asset, which is which is extremely solid chemistry. Absolutely, and uh, I think largely that is due to Kubro and his interruptions of, uh, of everything they're trying. If they, if they have a, a quick setup, he sees it and he acts to, to, to meet it. I think that's, that's very true. 
Fukuro, especially this forward. Yeah, Fukuro has been the MVP of this set. I have to say, you know, at least he has to get the support. Yeah. Ooh, that, that, that yeah, the, great stuff. the psych out didn't work. Yeah, good stuff from Alvin. The double? No. Oh, the reverse. Don't think Alvin wanted that reverse. Oh, sorry, it goes to one of them. Three to two each. Yeah, again, these have all been very close games. But for all their closeness, it really feels like Japan has been controlling the pace. Absolutely, the momentum is absolutely their favor. Even if it's even up, that doesn't mean it's not. Still working out. That back air is fantastic from both players. Oh, just look yeah. at that slobber knot. One holds ledge, one secures that they cannot use their, their up beat earlier, and they just die off ledge. Oh, tried to interrupt with uh, something there. But I feel like Takas and Alvin have really lost their groove. I feel they're like they're starting to realize. I think they're starting to adapt, at least uh, Alvin for sure. Wow, excellent uh, hits there. Uh, but they're starting to just see their, what, they're, what they're doing. I, I know that they're seeing that uh, Fugro is trying to interrupt, so they'll end their combos early to try to you know hit the Kirby away and then continue. Right. Both taking the skies. Yeah, they're and and that's another anti Fukuro play because he he's looking for aerial 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 superiority if you can take it away from him and for Pika yourself. Has it. All right, and there is a great combo. That up smash. That's something. That's what they good. needed. Oh, and the reverse back air is going to secure the stock. Yeah, e either way would have worked. If he'd yeah. gone the other way, then Alvin was there to confirm. This adaptation is actually working out for him. Yeah, and and that gives Green Team the lead for I think the first time this game. Yeah, right. Good there, doesn't kill. Uh, forward throw. There. Kill. Not quite, but they got the double edge guard. That's the situation they want to be in. That's the edge guard they needed too. No take. Most likely secure. And he's holding it. Nothing there. Okay, it's like here we see Alvin. 2v1. The lead is gone. And he goes straight for Fukuro, which I think is the correct option. Yeah, now but. Together. Yeah, also just Kirby has those down airs. I don't oh, interrupts that, but that's going to be... Wow, that dash attack saved him. It did. Good get-up attack. That was a crazy battle cap. Well, that was 1v1. Yeah, and he has more of a chance than ever. Alvin Kiyoshi, that's not looking throw. good. Seals That'll it. do it. And, three, and oh, that resets three, the bracket. Team Japan looking pretty good. But Alvin was smiling. You can see him smiling on the player cam. He's having oh. fun. Tacos is looking a little frustrated. Alvin's having a good time. Yeah, no matter what, this is great yeah. play. Tacos trying to calm down, keep it together a little bit. Yeah. Like Win or lose, these shake. are great matches. Shaking the hands. And they're sticking one. to their guns. Everyone's they're staying. doing it. So many hits just to start out. And there's Koshi, just coming in. Reaching out of the, uh, the top of that damage. Now they're battling each other. Uh, to, uh, to keep it away Kiyoshi. Taco's keeping away Fukuro. Uh, both of them together, see what they can do with it. Yeah, green team not able to support each other there. And you see, like, Alvin's just struggling to edgeguard Kiyoshi when Kiyoshi's edgeguards have been on point. Yeah, from both Japanese players, they've been absolutely on point. And I think that that is one of the major deciding factors, is that like once they get an opportunity, they're able to take it to the bank. And I Green mean, Team has had a very difficult time exactly. doing that this set. And that's the thing, is that the edge guards, that's how you seal the stocks. That's, that's it changes everything. Back here, let's see if uh, can follow it up. Fastball back here, knocking it down. But he's still safe. Both teams just trying to take the space right now and see what Japan did it, but then Green yeah. Team is now Move it on ground themselves. mode. Stick it on the Kirby. Oh, and the team combo takes a turn for the worse. Talk to play some good hits. Nothing really stringing to a stock. Alvin, absolutely stock taking. And it is gone. And so Green Team is still keeping it close, but they've been keeping it close every game this set. And this is the thing, this is the position that Japan wants to be in, where they're, they're up stock. 
at high percent. At high percent, and, and they, they're going to keep you out with moves that you can't, can't connect to, so they have a certain uh, availability of space that they, they now have at high percent. A lot of side platform pressure. Trying to keep the advantage. That's going to kill it. both players. Green team with a slight lead, but we've seen this before. Pretty much at the exact same point in this, in this game. Or in this game, rather. Yeah, that said, when it's green team that has a slight lead, that tends to be a pretty good sign for them. Great nair and down air. Fukuro doing fantastic the work. Team combo and edge guard right after each other. He's got great awareness. Yeah, and you. Yeah, that was nice coordinating their descent from the angel platform. Back here. Yeah. He's gonna get a position, but we'll see if Kyoshi can interrupt. Him. Oh, yep, Fugaro makes it back. Not even using the up. Very impressive. Just with the consistency of his of coming back and not getting edge guard himself. It's the yeah. other half of edge guarding, is knowing how to not to get edge guard yourself. Yeah, you gotta watch out for the swindle. And with Pikachu, it's a little bit more predictable, but yeah, All right. it's very good. So, green team managed to even up the step counts. High, and that will give them the edge. But they can't afford to take many hits. They can't afford to lose a stock. Oh man. Just look at Fuguro and Koski keeping Takos and Alvin away from each other. Both doing a great job of just keeping each other away. Just little hits here and there. That's all they need. And they're just they've been so good at applying pressure in two different directions. You can see Takos actually upbeat to the top platform just to get closer to Alvin and six being away from him. They need to be together to have this. Right, and right like that, you see that they were able to get an opening on Kukuro and carry him to the end. Up so back row. Ooh, oh, bad communication. Edge. Oh, that sucks. That could prove fatal. The fresh stock at 0%. Hate to see it. Tried to lock down the options, but Ledge was still one. Ooh, he still got the Flash neutral air. Pretty good. They're just trying not to let him land. Kiyoshi's keeping him away. That back throw. Into there. And, and that should do it. We'll do it. Takos and Alvin on the board for the first time this grand finals. And maybe Alvin was smiling for a reason. Maybe he knows something we don't. Yeah, maybe he maybe finally felt something. That's a very close game. So Team Japan looks like they're thinking about what to do as well. The second sets of the nice one. Maybe they just gotta use the first one to gather some data. That's definitely something Alvin does is to uh, like to gather data and figure you out. Excellent top platform pressure, no delivery. Didn't get the push off either. Actually just the, the, the Japanese. Over, yeah. yeah, and that was the Japanese plan, just separate them and then keep them separate. It's working out, now they're together, but they're still both off stage. Kill. So you can see Green Team trying to play cautiously. Now Japan just infiltrates the center stage. Trying to keep him away from Let there. Letting them in. Right there from okay, yeah, now she's on the other foot. And Fukuro makes it back again with no up. Yeah, they've been having a really tough time edge guarding Fukuro. His jumps, he just knows the jump height so well. He can utilize them incredibly. And, yeah, and you know, it. I haven't seen many other things like it, but one thing that I have seen like it is Wangara's recovery. Yeah, Wangara's fantastic as well. His yeah, signature like is, the, is the aerial to bring his, hit, uh, his hurt box away from you, but uh, absolutely the same. They both have fantastic knowledge of uh, work jump heights. And Fugro dies, 3-3. Three, three. Yoshi using the get-up attack again, he has fantastic knowledge of the timing of it. He uses it to interrupt uh, the intro very, very often. Wow. Stops to play with the down air, but unfortunately it sets him up to get back throw. Good attempt from uh, Super O. 
Dash second up, so it doesn't combo. All right, yeah, so this, this is a critical juncture for green team. Right now, green team is keeping solid. If Alvin can manage to hang on to this stock for a bit longer, if they can manage to clinch maybe one more stock. Uh, both players, both Japanese players land critical hits. Oh That's yeah, two, two. and Tacos trying to keep it cool. Very exciting situation. Be a very clutch game to have. This. It's true that if the momentum starts to swing back in Team Japan's favor, it's pro it, it feels like it's going to be very difficult to take it back. Yeah, both Pikas is sticking to the ground, trying to keep them landing. A lot of up airs, a lot of up tilts. Mostly up airs. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a very good game plan. Especially, especially when you know that your opponents are trying to take the air themselves. If you take that away from them, it's an air, not a kill, but. And it does look like they're making some headway. And Taco's going to the right. Yeah, green team not edge guarding like, uh, yeah, like that, Japan does, but unfortunately, Fufuro does take that stock. Uh, yeah, yeah, that team kill might spell the end for Team Japan this game. That's exactly what Alvin and Taco need. Keep them in it. Oh, and green team looking in a pretty advantageous position. Tacos, Tacos has still managed to hold on to that life in, until this very moment. Finally, he lets it go. But both Fukuro and Kiyoshi are now in, uh, in very good, uh, in very, they're very, they're at a very right percent. That zombie will take it. Not sure whose it was. Yeah, that's uh, that's a, that's a funny double. Okay, there it was Takos. So now, one thing, one of the things, probably the thing that I like the least about the ROM hacks that we're using is that for some reason there's some bug or some weird internal thing that prevents us from being able to display the kill count at the end. Yeah, that is true. I'm and not sure what the, uh, what the deal is with that, but yeah. unfortunately and it currently is true. In teams, like, I would have been very interested to know what green team's, like, kill division yes, was. Yes. Because, like, I, I know Taco's got those last two kills. I wouldn't be surprised if he got a lot of other kills besides. Taco's definitely seem to be uh, taking things into his own hands here. So yeah, that's, his thing as well. that's that's not really what you expect from this uh, from the from this team with these players. Absolutely not. But it seems that they're that's their, their, their falling back onto. And it, it's definitely work, working out for them. They they're figuring something out. They have managed two games straight against Team Japan, a team that just went 3-0 on them. So now, as long as they can keep it together. Now with the first blood. Trade hits. Taco's really trying to focus on punishing uh, Team Japan's attempts to, to attack Alvin as well. Yeah, which is that support role that you'd expect Alvin or Taco's to be playing. Excellent edge guard from Alvin. Yeah, Doesn't just not him. even approaching Fukuro. And up air works. Taco's having to fade back. Alvin's stuck in the middle. Taco secures the back throw. Yeah, I, I feel that now the green team has started to play a little farther apart from each other when they're like during the beat, they're they've been managing to make more things happen. And I think this is something that we saw Team Mehor do as, as well. They started playing a little farther apart. They started being able or having more ability to come in to, uh, to help out. Ninety seconds into the game, and Taco loses his first sock. Yeah, now green team is starting to really let the combo rip. Taco's laying down solid interference to let Alvin go out for the edge guard with impunity. And this time, Japan is actually down by more than one stock. Yeah, it's it, well. Or at least not wow. Set, right? Yeah, and, and that is Alvin right there. That is the work that Alvin does. Alvin is going in. Just died, but Taco is happy to stock tank. 
in 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 this player composition, I think that that's an extremely good thing for him to be doing. Supporting, keeping those stocks alive. This album is more than happy to combo Yoshi till the end. Yeah, so five against three. That's that is a convincing lead. And Green Team has really managed to just start running circles around the blue team. Yeah, it's not exactly that they're that they're having team combos or amazing composition, but their position is good. That was good right there. But uh, it seems their individual uh, talents are, and individual interactions are paying off the most. Yeah, and I, I think that what they've done is just adjust their, their neutral spacing to more closely match to the, the Japanese teams. Exactly. Because, like you say, they, they haven't been doing anything super flashy. They've just really pulled it together and managed to put themselves in a, in a the best position to support each other. I see where this hits. going to be at the right place at the right time. And it's also true, I've got to mention it, they've been keeping Fukuro on the ground. Yeah, right. I've not noticed. And yeah, I, putting him in the air is a scary spot, so that's a good idea. And I think that that has been enabled by their change in spacing. Perhaps, yes. They've been both kind of floating above in different, in different areas like that. They're just denying him the ground. Yeah, they, they've they're been denying like, him the air by you know, keeping him on the ground there. Yeah, and they've been stationing somebody on the top platform to be there so that Fukuro can't really approach. And you know what? It looks like it, it's paying off. No double. Yeah. Fukuro is still oh, fighting, but that'll do it. And Tacos Alvin will be your doubles champions for Genesis 5.